it climaxes at the at the old thing where all the people of the kingdom have come together to celebrate the sol summer solstice and uh, at this time the constellations somehow have a setting of the stars and as the Stonehenge was was also like a clock set with the stars then at this special point the gate of eternity can be opened and uh, it is done during the during the last battle is the dragon that the prince has to win when the girl is tied to the dragon he has to ride down the egg hill and the dragon is Ouroboros meaning that it is um, so large that it surrounds with its tail the entire hill able to uh, grasp uh, its tail with its mouth with a uh, formal analysis of filmmaking it is always important to structure the film and the uh, filmmaker usually structures so that there are scenes and acts and units and so on and each of these elements has so to say a highest emotional point the climax uh, the place or spot where the light shines brightest so to say where the emotion is strongest and as this uh, whole story has three different uh, storylines uh, or main things that drive through it uh, one of them uh, being the dragon is drawn fighting the dragon fighting the chaos uh, the second is Quinby gets the prince so the story of the prince and princess their relationship uh, the third one the gate is open. The eternity is doing the good for the uh, for the entire community, bringing it to a new level, um, where prince and princess become the new royal king and queen, the gods. In uh, in a result, uh, eternities are open for all to follow at the right time with the right one, and uh, it will be left to the viewer which one of these three stories they choose to be most important to them and most emotional to them what do they really want out of life what is most important usually it is the romantic part of things and that's why I think that the climax of the film is uh, when Prince McCollum is carrying Quinby up the hill right after he has enlivened her saving her from the dragon and uh, bringing her up the hill that is a subtle and uh, so to say very light feeling that now it is over he has done it he deserves it and they deserve to be gods they deserve to be taken to the new dimension that is beyond comprehension and now they are together they have got each other and they cannot do it alone they cannot open the gate by themselves for themselves but for each other and so also everyone in this film can do it at the right time for their companion for the one who is their soulmate who loves them supports them helps them fill the dory chest or whatever the tasks are demanded from us in this life.